Hey everybody, it's Murgle, and today I'm on the PTR again because the Malemental pet has been discovered. At least how to get it. It's not really a secret, but it is a fun little quest chain. Uh, I'm excited to share it with you. Again, this is on the PTR, but it's really good information for you to know when it hits live. Now, this quest chain is like a rare spawn starting quest chain. At least it is currently. All these things are subject to change like anything on PTR. But it starts with this item called Lost Mail, right? And this item spawns at exactly the mailbox directly below the big old tower, right at this little spot here. And I looted it because um, as soon as you loot it, it despawns. And uh, only one person can loot it at this point in time because I'm with Knight Swifty. Uh, he grabbed it two hours ago. I said I would camp and see how long it spawns. I was just sitting there waiting to it and it spawned exactly two hours following when Knight Swifty looted it. So now we're going to find out exactly how this works what happens um this quest looks fun has a lot of exciting little things to it excited to show you but let's get to it all right so our first step here begins in the underbelly and um you have to go to madame goya who is the black market auction house individual and you can see this little short conversation you have you missed your payment one too many times mr stonebrow i'm repossessing the goods per our contract i mailed ye the check this morning i swear you can't leave me high and dry. Mr. Chu, please see this dwarf out. Miss Zelion, Zilion, relist the armor. Yes, madame. And keep your paws off me, fuzzball. So let's see what this quest is. What's this? You are not my usual courier. Ah, a banknote. Mr. Stonebrow's payment. Just in the nick of time, it would seem. It seems you're luck today, Mr. Stonebrow. You may take back the goods. Poor guy's naked. You're, you're damn right, I will. I bought this armor fair and square, and even if I ain't done paying for it... Ah, that's better. Armor befitting a mighty hero. Look, he's wearing tier 3. <laughs> uh, okay, so what does that entail afterwards? Oh, I'm off to the tavern. Thanks for your help. Lad, I owe you one. Nothing is fine. Alright, well. So that's done the postmaster sent me mail let's go check what they got to say all right we got our mail here let's see help wanted dear Murgle, it has come to my attention that you handled the delivery of a missing parcel for that you have my gratitude we're in somewhat of a crunch here in the mail room and i have need of an a capable courier if you're interested please visit my office you will find the entrance behind the magus commerce exchange the postmaster let's go uh find that Alrighty, so at the location, you can see all these mail letters flying down into here quickly. And uh, much like Mario, you just jump into the tube, but it's right here on the Major's Commerce. So let's hop in. And you pop in in the Postmaster's office. You can see all these things. Floating letters. Obviously, a magical town's got magical letters. But it says, Neither snow, nor cataclysm, nor demon invasion will stay will stay us from our appointed duty. The mail must flow. Alright. That's some serious dedication. Return to sender. You've arrived just in time. Unlike the mail as of late, I'm afraid, we are severely understaffed and demand is at an all-time high. We simply can't keep up. I'd love to chat, but I need... Help catching up before I can rest for a mo even a moment. First things first, several parcels of rejected mail have broke, broken loose again. Will you help me round them all up and return them to their senders? Sure. Rejected mail. So these flying things? Wait, it says bad handwriting. Okay, I want to see what these say. Not enough stamps. Return to sender. Not enough stamps. Bad handwriting. Bad handwriting. I wonder if this happens often. Somebody out there, a postal worker, do you have to return for bad handwriting all the time? Return to sender. Not enough stamps. All right, so we've collected nine. So what do you got here? You're an absolute natural. Say, do you mind sticking around for a while? I could sure use a helping hand. What? Well, 
Due to the incredible volume of complaints in recent months, we have been barred from delivering s s the postmaster's uh, holds back tears, pain visible in his eyes, solid stone. <laughs> We're positively swimming in it. If we can't deliver it, then pretty soon we'll be over what the postmaster's eyes suddenly light up, or light up suddenly. That's it. There's an old Constorium portal not far from here. We could deposit it in with None the wiser. Can you help me, Murgle? The stone is extraordinarily heavy. Deliver 1,362 pieces of solid stone to Ethro Portal in Dalaran. That's a really Cadgar-esque number. Katie would help me, Murgle, and go open the Constorium Portal by the Antonitis Memorial. Oh. Oh, the little male elemental. Is this? It's gonna help me? No, Katie. Oh, hello. So let's head over there. There's the portal in this section of Dalaran. I see. So there was a sack when you were you come back. So you have to pick up this item. Oh, you walk incredibly slow with it. I see now. So once you picked it up, um, now you're gonna walk back. I, I guess. <laughs> Even when mounted and trying to fly, you still move at an incredibly slow rate. Let's see if warlocks. Nope, because this removes all movement impairing effects and sometimes it even works for quest movement impairment but I guess in this case nothing is speeding you up at this point you're just gonna walk real slow all right here we go we're walking up at a snail's pace do it Whoop. see you later what's this more of this blasted stone you will pay for this, stranger. I will find you, and I will destroy you. Oh my, that doesn't sound good. Go ahead and head back to the postmaster. Hehe, <laughs> dismantle this portal real quick. That's what gnomes sound like, right? Let's go back, see what happens from this point. This is so much faster. Wow, it took me like five minutes to walk over there and like ten seconds to get back. Da -da -da. Okay. There's like a, <laughs> a small slow fall there. <laughs> Alright. What do we have here? Is the deed done? <laughs> like, it's such a tragic thing. Oh, I love this quest. This is funny. An adventure... What? Peharadam, no mind. Deep down, I know he appreciates all that free stone. Yeah, I'm sure he does. An adventurer of another time has forgotten to loot something big. Something that might cause them great emotional strain, if not received quickly. Your destination is Ice Crown Citadel. Your target, the Lich King's corpse. Retrieve the missing item post-haste and deliver it to the stalwart adventurer. He should be somewhere at the steam pools in Feralis. My assistant will open a portal to deliver you there. Just a moment. Recover the forgotten loot from the Lich King and find its intended recipient. Alright. Let's do this. One portal coming up. Doop. Here we go. There's his body. The Lich King. What? What? Being attacked. Dibs, dibs, I call dibs. Do you know how long I've been waiting for this? Alright, so... It appears that these fellows are, uh, thieves. Anybody else? What do we get here? The Invincible's Reigns. We've looted Invincible's Reign. This infamous mount of the Lich King is sought by many collectors. Yeah, you're right, it is. You mortals all the same, fighting but not knowing what for. Pity, you would have made an excellent servant. Alright. Guessing this is a portal directly to our adventurer. Nope, looks like we gotta go find him. Let me get there real quick. So here we are in Feralus. We're gonna fly down there and see him. But it's safe to say the uh, sword has now appeared on PTR. Some changes over there, but we'll worry about that later, huh? 
I'm the elf here. What? I'm the elf your elf could be if he was me, okay? Johnny Awesome. Oh, let's look at him. Now Johnny Awesome. Got a group here, people. Resort guests. Resort guests, resort guests. No cool names, just resort guests. But Johnny Awesome sure does like himself the Winman, you know? You know what I mean? Hold, peasant. What business have you with the illustrious? Johnny Awesome. You'd best carry a reason of a higher caliber than that to dare interrupt my time with these buxom beauties. He's already got it. Spooky. <laughs> oh, simple human. Simple, simple human. I did not forget to sweep up those reins from that foolish cakewalk of a knight they call the Lich King. I simply did not bother, as I had already received the mighty steed during my raid last week. Johnny motions to the horse on his left. Since you're here, and clearly intrigued by my sweltering greatness, won't you take that superfluous stallion to the assistant resort director in town? My coffers could use a bit of extra lining. Sell Invincible's reins to Gaunt Weedle Span for Johnny Awesome. <laughs> okay. Now, don't keep me waiting, Philistine. Chop chop. So just over here in the resort, so not too far off. You just fly over the hill. And he's right here, you gotta talk to Gaunt Weedle Span. Gaunt sneers contemptuously at you. Can you possibly work any slower? I'm surrounded by useless idiots. I have to sell this horse to you. Whoa, well, man, are you sure this ain't some sort of prank? Unfortunately, yes. Pleasure doing business with you. You just made my freaking career, pal. So, how much did he pay for it? Bulging sack of gold. This is clearly below the value of such a rarity, but what do you care? Alright, well. I mean, we're talking Black Market at Arkham House. That uh, goes for quite a bit. Do not tarry, Warlock. The longer you take, the longer until you may dope on me as one of my many admirers. <laughs> Johnny raises his arms exasperately, glancing at his naked wrist. My, my, quite the lethargic adventurer, aren't you? That might just cover my repair bills from the many dungeons I've blundered. <laughs> You've served me well these past few minutes we've spent together. Minutes I shall not soon forget. I believe a reward befitting your unwaveringly loyalty is in order. You have the distinct honor of placing Twinkle's favorite toy by his grave in honor of his memory. Please, please, save your thanks for Twinkle's. It is not every day that we may honor a horse made of stars. Place Twinkle's favorite toy by his grave. Sludge fields in Hillsbrad foothills. Do hurry, Mergelstein, or whatever you said it was, or I shall find another plebeian upon who to bestow this great honor. Look at that level 62 elite in uh, Hillsbrad foothills. But anyways... If you ever forget about these, these challenger paths can be really useful. This is what you got for doing the mop gold challenge modes. And um, that was a really easy teleport up here. Just a tip if you happen to have those unlocked. But anyways, let's go ahead and twinkles. This is Mimaron's head. So apparently he's a fan of Mimaron's head. Let's honor Twinkle's memory. Quest complete. Hopefully this is the last you see of Johnny Awesome and his menagerie. Okay. Wilson. So. Do reward. Oh, it must be bugged. I already did it. Let's see what we gotta do from this point. Probably head back to Dalaran, I think. I see now I happen to receive more mail. I got a letter from the Postmaster and Johnny Awesome, so... Johnny Awesome. Dearest Mergle, I look back upon our adventures together as if they happened yesterday. Several of my admirers informed me that you looked rather sullen, well, when we last met. 
While I see no reason for such behavior when you had the pleasure of working with the world-renowned Johnny Awesome, I did feel a twang of, what was it, pity. Bring as such, I felt it appropriate to send you this tip as a token of my appreciation for your efforts. Do people still tip? If people do not still tip, please return all attachments to me at once, along with a small amount of coin to cover my shipping costs. <laughs> so he wants to pay you back, or he wants you to pay him so he can get it back. But look, he gives you a free twi Time Warren Heirloom armor case, and I think those are like 5k, so I mean it's a decent reward, right? Upgrade an Heirloom armor to 100, so there you go. Buff to your BOAs. And then we got this letter from the postmaster. Mergul, in your absence, things at the office have gone quite awry. There's mail everywhere, and I do mean everywhere. Katie and I will never sort all of this in timely manner without your aid. I'm afraid I must ask you to return to the office at once. We have a job to do. See, this is what they were talking about at the end of Argus. We have a job to do, hero. As do you. <laughs> Alright, let's head in there, see what's up. Mail everywhere. It doesn't look any more messy to me. It's about the same. Due to all the recent shenanigans, I'm running short on mailamentals to sort letters. It's a simple job, really. Just toss the letter into the proper portal where it will be whisked away to the far corners of Azeroth and beyond. I like to make a little game out of it. How many can you sort in one minute? Help the postmaster sort at least 15 letters within the time limit. So, let's see what we gotta do. And where do we do this? Hello? Oh, I'm ready to sort letters. I got it. Yeah, let's keep. So, Northren. One keg. Uh, Bandaria. On a hold. Outland. I see. Warsong. Boring Tundra. Northrend. Northrend. Eastern Kingdom. Kalimdor. This is fun. Kinda, you know. Uh, Pandaria. Outland. Northrend. Eastern Kingdom. Pandaria. Eastern Kingdom and Outlands Crossroads. Oh, so we have to do this as fast. Okay, it keeps going. So I guess we just gotta. Better if we remember where everything's at. Dread Waste, Pandaria. Okay, sort at least. Alright, we got 21, so. Here we go. Well, oh, he doesn't. Let us turn it in. Well done. It is not fulfilling to see each letter safely s to its destination. Come by and help me anytime. The total package. What is this? Find the postmaster in Dalaran and lend him your aid. Oh, we get the title reward courier. So, it can be courier Mergle. So, let's see what post haste is. Accept doesn't say anything maybe it's just to do this again so let's quickly do this see how fast we can do it not doing very well at this let's try it let's see hold on because there's an achievement around this Oops. priority mail sort 30 matters letters all right so we got to do this in time for 30 so let's try this again we're gonna keep doing this till we get 30 Okay, after a couple of attempts, I managed to get the achievement, Priority Mail, which is uh, the quest as well, so, post haste. No dialogue, maybe this is just a bug and it would have dialogue in the live game, but, yep, managed to complete it. Now, I'm going to show you a little tip, or at least how, because it did take a couple of attempts, but what you want to do is when you're playing the game, don't look at the first words. Just look at where it says the zone is. That way you can go from zone, say, oh, Darkshore, Kalimdor, Grizzly Hills, Northrend, Don Moro, Eastern Kingdoms, Hellfire Peninsula, Outland, 
if you start looking at this, it's wasting your time because it does get pretty, like, you know, you come pretty close to the time, right? It's not a, you don't have much time left by the time, even if you're going semi-fast, right? You're uh, still in some trouble at the end of it. Like, I barely got 31, and 30 is the minimum. So just a tip there. At least that's how I did it. Don't look at the first name. Just look at the what zone it is. So, we have some mail again from the postmaster. Let's go read what he has for us. So here we are in a mailbox. Click on it. The postmaster. Through sleet and snow. Mergle, it is through your actions and heroism <laughs> that the mail continues to flow successfully throughout Azeroth and beyond. However, I must come clean. I have not been completely honest with you. The events which first brought you here were orchestrated. I knew you were the only one that could save the post office from an undue end. I cannot rely on you forever. The mail must be able to operate without your aid. I must ask you to help me orchestrate one more to guide more into the stamped halls to give me aid. Take the attachment message and send it to someone you deem worthy to carry, carry the torch forward. I've included a whistle to call Katie to your side should you need her aid. I trust you in the end. Bulging package. Alright. And then May Lamental. Oh, here we go. I got this twice. I don't think that's intentional. Yeah, that's a bug. Gotta report that, but yeah, they send it to me twice. But let's see what the May Lamental. Mergul, you are no doubt familiar with my mail moving marvelous minions, the. Oh my gosh, May Lamentals. <laughs> they have been of great aid in my duties and admittedly great comfort during our recent trials and tribulations. It would seem one of them has taken a rather strong liking to you. I suspect it was impressed by your rather exceptional agility in sorting all the ghastly, improperly organized letters. Though it pains me greatly to do so, I am left with little choice. You shall find your new companion enclosed within the mail. Worry not, Melaminos actually find the confines of a well-creased envelope quite comfortable. You may use it as a create... what? You may use it as a crate of sort if you so desire. Crate of sort if you so desire. Okay, well let's, let's go ahead and open this bulging package first. So, toy. Katie's Stamp Whistle. Call through sleet and snow, Katie Stamp Whistle, Postmaster Assistant Extraordinaire. Katie will deliver and receive retrieve mail for 10 minutes or until she is called elsewhere. So you get a 3 hour cooldown, infinite use mailbox toy. I guess the mail mental probably won't have that function, it's probably just a pet. You also get a bind when used, lost mail. <laughs> this is a... um. This is the item that starts the quest, so you can actually sell this, I imagine, on the auction house. You can trade it to other people, uh, anything of that sort. Probably really good money if you're willing to camp this as soon as 7.3.5 comes live. Because, you know, collectors will pay a whole bunch of stuff for things early. But this means infinitely that even if you pay a lot for this um, lost mail envelope yourself so you can do the quest, you might be able to resell the envelope for basically the price you just bought it for. That's kind of cool. Uh, and then, of course, Solid Stone. Panic sell Solid Stone because, obviously, we're going to get <laughs> an influx of it into the game. But, okay, let's go ahead and learn that. Learn that. Okay. And then, of course, the quest item. Oh, we'll see here. Pet. Or let's go ahead and summon her real quick, see what it does. There you go. You rang. When you talk to her, I'd like to check my mail. So she just a portable mailbox. Seems pretty useful. It's like the moly pet, but for everybody, right? Only engineers can use the moly pet. Or the moly toy, sorry. Salutations. So that's all she does. Pretty useful. This assistant must go where the mail must flow. So after ten minutes she just vanishes. Even though the flavor text makes it sound like she can vanish at any point, I imagine she won't. And then the pet, May Lamental. So, pet journal, May Lamental. Let's see what this little guy does. Summon him. Can he interact or anything? Any kind of interaction? Clicking on him. Nope, nothing happens. So, uh, 
this is your portable mailbox, which is to be expected. I don't think they would give you two in one little thing, but yep, you do get a toy that acts like a portable mailbox alongside your little pet. So that looks like a good little screenshot there, huh? Anyways, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. I can't wait for this to come to live. This was actually really funny. I liked the dialogue and I uh, hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. So anyways, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you again real soon. Bye-bye.